This is Michael Hill reporting for Superbike News TV here at Mazzano for the fourth round of the European Superstock 600 Championship 2012. I'm joined now by two of the riders that race uh, for the Team Go 11 Kawasaki squad, the Australian Matt Davies and uh, Dutch rider Tony Covenia. Um, guys, uh, thanks for joining us uh, before your second qualifying session. Uh, really, really good showing from the Go 11 team uh, yesterday in qualifying, which is really good to see. I want to start by just speaking with, uh, with Matt a little bit and uh, just tell us a little bit about what you've been doing since, uh, since Monza. A great result for you uh, in, in the rain coming through the pack to finish in 10th position. So uh, you've carried that form with you this weekend and provisionally on the fourth row of the grid. Um, I was at home after Monza and we sort of just went around there and just did a bit of training and then just caught up with the family and my girlfriend and you know all of that and then we had to come back over we had a test last week so no it was really i really enjoyed it to be at home and no, it was good and uh, tony same question uh, monza is behind us the rain is well and truly behind us uh, again you must be feeling really good for the race uh, very strong showing from you uh, well inside the top 10 uh, in both sessions yesterday yeah it was good uh, yeah i had a good uh, first qualifying and uh, yeah the pace is uh, the pace is there and uh, yeah, now for the second qualifying, the aim is uh, yeah, to get a little bit higher and uh, maybe get on the first row. And uh, just for the benefit of people watching, um, you guys uh, obviously are teammates, so on the track you, uh, you want to kill each other and uh, knock hell out of each other and obviously be the best. But uh, that rivalry also continues off the track, as we, uh, we found out at Superbike TV this weekend when we, uh, we took you along to a, to a karting challenge. And uh, there, were, there were lap records and cheating and disqualifications, but uh, who, who was the winner of that? I think it was me, yeah. <laughs> well, I was just glad I come away off the lap record, you know, sort of 46-1, you can't really beat that, so. But the question is, do lap records count if you cut three of the corners? This is the question. No, it doesn't work, man. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. But uh, it's good to see, obviously, you guys working together, uh, obviously, within the team. Um, do you guys share any, any data with the, with the bikes, or do you kind of run, run separately, just to give us some understanding of how you guys work within the team? Uh, yeah, we work together. Uh, yeah, it's still uh, yeah. You work on your own bike, so uh, yeah, you're more on your own than yeah together. But uh, yeah, still we uh, we work together. We yeah look around the track and um, yeah just share a little bit. So uh, yeah. And looking at the times uh, in qualifying for the Superstock race this weekend, I think there's less than three quarters of a second covering the first ten or twelve. It's going to be a really, really close race. I'm guessing, Matt, from your point of view, there's not going to be any, any team orders, and uh, providing you obviously don't cut any corners in the race, you should be on for a good one. Yeah, hopefully. You know, I'm, we've still got another qualifying. I'm only 1.4 seconds off pole, so I'm, and I'm 17th. So from I think from 20th to first is only 1.8 seconds or something. So it's going to be a really close race, I think. And hopefully, I just can get away at the start and just run off the front runners. I know we speak a lot, Matthew, uh, at all of the races. Uh, have you got a message for anyone uh, 20 odd thousand kilometres away back in Australia that uh, are waiting for this interview? I know I've received a number of emails already asking when we're going to speak to you. So, have you got any message back for, for, for your mum, girlfriend, family back, back in Australia? I would just like to say hello, you know, uh, say hello to my girlfriend, Abby, my mum, and my brother, Tyler. Um, yeah, just I'm enjoying the sun while they're in the freezing cold at home. So, no, it's good. They'll be over here next, I think, two weeks now. So, it'll be good to have them over here. And you'll be praying for rain, obviously, when they arrive. Um, probably not, no. <laughs> no and Tony, I know that uh, you don't travel uh, quite as far as, uh, as Matt, but uh, again, for, for the benefit of anybody maybe that wants to, to follow you or your progress um, through, throughout, obviously, this season and your future career, do you have like a, a website? Is there anywhere that people can, can follow your progress? Yeah, yeah, on my own website, uh, yeah, www.tonycovina.com. And uh, yeah, I also got my own blog on there, so check it out. Guys, really nice talking to you. We're going to let you go because I think you've only got about an hour to go till, till second qualifying. Have a good race. Uh, try to keep it friendly uh, on track. And uh, we'll, see, uh, we'll see whether the, uh, the, the go-karting result is the same uh, after the 12-lap race at 6 o'clock today. We're going to hope for it. Thank you.